Hello there, it's Chess Tech, and tonight we are going for a recovery session. And you may ask, what do I mean by that? Well, look at this. Well, I've been absolutely pulverized rating recently, dropped well below 2050 that I was maintaining. And part of the reason for that is, is that you may or may not know my previous videos. I mentioned that I, I only play three minute plus two second increment blitz. And I decided to switch to just three minute flat in a dit last dish attempt to try and get break the 2100 barrier in blitz. Um, which has been a quite a long goal now. And it's just taking forever and going on and on. I keep getting very close to it. And then... Um, just uh, blundering away, you know. So, if I want a pawn here, that's the question. Yeah, I thought he might do that. Um, so, yeah. And what's happened actually is um, I can totally see why in, um, in in the professional blitz circles, you know, in the World Blitz Championship, that they they play with increment because the the difference in the games. It's absolutely incredible. It is literally, they are two different games of chess, really. I mean, you still have to use your brain in three minute blitz for that increment. Of course you do. But, oh, you know, I just don't think it's anywhere near as, uh, um, that's what I'm looking for. It just doesn't. Sorry, I invade on this back rank here. I don't think it's going to get me anywhere, that. Um, it's just, oh, you know, it's just, you can just like hammer people with no real skill. And especially if you're quick on the clock at the end, it doesn't work with an increment. It does not mean shit. If you're, you know, switch the increment on. Let's see if we can exchange one of these bishops. It's a little bit too strong, though, for them. I know his white square bishop's not doing much, but... Yeah, he's not going to fall for that, is he? We're just desperate. And I've just started playing like Desperado Chess. I mean, I know three minute plus two is hardly, you know, what you describe as a super long game. But um, I just, you know, you do think about the position in those three seconds, you know. And you just do play a better quality chess, I think. Um, so what have I done here now? Blundered and... Oh, no, I've given away a pawn. Um... So I think I'm going to reassess this. So he's just lost. Oh, from here, I thought he lost his bishop there. Now, my knight might be a better piece here in some ways. I don't know, it might not be. I know I've trouble defending those my dark square pawns, actually. And it's quite interesting as well, because um, I found this right really strange. Bring my king into the middle a bit more. It's a really strange like phenomenon where... Um, uh, Initially, when I was around like late 2000s, 2008, 2080, 2070, getting close to 2100 goal, when I first started playing um, uh, these guys, I just pulverized them. It was like incredible, you know? And um, got to try and find a better square for my knight here. I've got a real. My, my peace coordination is abject at the moment. I'm going to get marmalized here. That, my pawn's gone, isn't it? Why hasn't he just gone take that pawn? You could have won a pawn then. I just don't understand it. You can just win a pawn here, can't you? Yeah, my, my position is absolutely horrific. I'm in big, 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 big trouble. Check. Takes the pawn. Doesn't get me anything, does it? Hmm. Can't lose two pawns. Yeah. I don't think I've got anything going there at all. I mean, this is this is what I'm on about. This is just a horrific position. Going to put me queen a pawn. 
I can't. Uh, and yeah, I, I just, I really just don't know um, any other way to describe it other than um, he's got to do something about that prawn, hasn't he? Um, he bring his own prawn, prawn down, I guess. All I need to do is get my somehow get my rook up there. I've got 20 seconds. I mean, this is absolutely abject game of chess. The only saving virtue is that his. I was just about to say that. Uh, um, I don't even have him on top. I have literally nothing in this position at all. I'm hoping to just take that pawn. Thank you. Kind of helps me a bit that move. I've got six seconds. Yeah, I mean, in this, in this, what you're witnessing here is a is a classic example of just uh, bad chess, really. Again. Um, just, I think really think it's being outplayed. It's just, just playing by moves. There's no point in even playing on, really. I'm just, uh, I should just resign. So, I was going to try and get back to two thousand tonight. Play a few games early. Got a pole vision. I know he wants another game. That's nice. So. Yeah, so we've got Scandinavian. The, the, this, um, it's like, um, kind of like when I was playing these uh, 1900 players initially, my chest must have gone downhill because I was just pulverizing them. I won a load and load of games in a row, and I was ranting about how poor the quality of chess was from these players. But all of a sudden, I'm drifting. Far away from uh, 2000, and um, I'm a bit ill at the moment. I suppose that's one I could make some excuses. I've been pretty ill, got a knackered shoulder, I'm tired. I need to need Christmas to come early. I'm sick of work. I'm just literally, um, I'm just absolutely fucked at the moment, really. Excuse my French, I just don't have any energy, I'm not playing. You know, I'm, I'm just being, um, I'm just playing like shit, really. Like this, this is a prime example. Look at this, I mean, I don't even see anything. You know, and um, I don't know why that is. Maybe it's just, you know, um, just, just a symptom of um, the end of the year, you know. I made a video for, I haven't felt like making a video. So we could exchange queens here. I don't really like exchanging queens, as you know. I'm quite fond of my queen. Can I take that pawn? I'm going to take it. I'm getting... Like, it's been quite a few occasions where... Lucky I kept that b7 pawn. Because I'd be just destroyed now. Um... I see, okay. I really need to exchange. Dark Square Bishop's very powerful. It's annoying my game. Let's exchange a few pieces off. Um, yeah, maybe I can push that pawn actually down the A file. Create a threat that isn't really a threat. So. I could exchange just exchange some piece off. And yeah, I just there's been quite a few games where I genuinely uh, hmm doesn't look very good that does it? I I have to pay I'm gonna get checked here and get pulverized. Yeah, I I genuinely had a good position. I was winning on time or equal on time. I just can't, couldn't make anything happen. So I can't. Now I can. That's not the right move, was it? I want to play, obviously, f5. And, um, I want to play f5. It doesn't work. Something's 
bad's going to happen here. I'm not happy with this position. It's not looking good. And that probably was the bad thing, yeah. It's a very dodgy position. I need to exchange queens, actually. I'm mean, pawn up, but I'm positionally... I've got a big problem. Things like that are not looking good. That's a good move. That is a good move. I mean, you can make me here, can't you? Because I can't play. See, like, things like that. It's like, <sighs> I don't think he really planned that. He didn't see that sequence of moves. He's just played a check and it's turned out that I mated now. Or I lose my queen because I can't play. Um, yeah, I just lose my queen here. So that's incredible, you know. I think that's what I'm finding. That's the sort of moves I'm finding that I'm losing the game. You know, it's um, really strange, you know. And like I say, I don't really believe that it's any kind of um, really been outplayed or anything. It's just sort of bit lame really I'm not even there's no real point even playing on here because I literally have 18 seconds left and nobody could lose his position yeah so I just resign this I'm a bit annoyed about this player I wouldn't mind a rematch actually so I've been pulverised again and again and um, I don't know what it is but I need to find some kind of rhythm um, so maybe you know happen the other day actually I mean if we look at my game I'm like, just and that, and that's the other thing that's happened actually recently it's not a phenomenon you couldn't really say but this thing where I pulverize people like five or six games in a row row and it's all wonderful and then I just completely collapse and lose, like, I don't know, must have a isolated Queen's Pawn. Like, would literally lose 10 games in a row. Just bang, straight off 10 games in a row. And a couple of those, like, I probably should have won, they'll be close losses, but most of them would just be shit games that I totally deserve to lose. And that's really uh, interesting as well. Because um, I don't know what the cause of that is. And this position is appalling as well for me. Absolutely appalling. Um, there's nothing here whatsoever. Nothing. And I, I don't even know why I played that move then, actually. Um, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just hacking here. Yeah, there's, there's nothing here. I just played that move at Queen. It was just a vague hope of um, creating some cheapo tactic, and he just didn't see it. It's just luck. Um, nothing good about that. All I'm going to do is take the e4 pawn and hope that you don't see some sort of mate like that. I mean, you see this. This is appalling. This is absolutely appalling. You know, that's not. I'm not happy with that. I'm not happy with winning like that. It's not very. It's not a good win, Scandinavian. And I tell you this: he's going to play d4. If he's not in his brains, you know, these people, they've been reading some Scandinavian books or like some theory, and they they are finding that they're they're actually beginning to play some decent lines against it. They still collapse when they have to use their brain. You know, when it comes to it, you get this kind of stale position in the scandal though, quite a lot. It's coming up in about three or four moves. And they start playing moves that aren't theory, theory, which gives me a, theoretically, a probably a decent position. Not a winning position or anything, but just a, a decent position. Um, Down. It's 
player's not very good, really. I mean, I've lost him twice, and you probably say, well, how can you say he's not very good when you're the one losing to him twice? It's just because of the chess. Like I say, there's nothing there. There's something wrong with it. Like I say, it's just a kind of chess that's... Um, I just don't know. So I'm going to try and tap my weak b7 pawn with his queen. Well, knight's quite irritating there. Maybe I could play knight b4 next move. And they're quick. I mean... I almost want to say the standard of three minute chess with no brain has gone up in the last year. I'm threatening B uh, knight C2 here. So he hasn't, he's decided that he's happy for that. I don't know why. But he's going to win a pawn. It's uh, strange, but I definitely realise that I've, the repertoire is going to have to come up with a new opening, a new response to e4 in the new year. I nearly took his rook then, and I really did. I nearly took his rook and just let him have a queen for nothing. Which knight should we? T which rook should we have off? I think we'll have this one off. Right, so maybe I can win a... I've got that bishop there, so I can't threaten his knight straight away, which is really annoying. Threaten that pawn, can I? For a minute, it's not doing any. It's not a great move, that. Can I threaten this pawn? I could do with him exchanging his... Um... I might try and get his knight, actually. Any peace coordination here? I knew he was going to do that. It's going to end up with a couple of passed pawns in a one position. It's, it's coming, isn't it? You know it's coming. I have to exchange bishop or something. I haven't even got him. It's like giving him a passed pawn. He's not a bad little hacker, this guy. This is the thing. You know, because taking that bishop then, I think we'll take that. Kind of weird position. Can I? Giving him a nice, uh, I suppose I might better win that pawn. You can think I've lost a rook there, haven't I? Well, I've not lost a rook, but you could have just threaten my could have just where's his knight gonna go? Could just threaten my rook, you know. Maybe I can maybe it swings some roundabouts. I still think I think this is I think this is much better for this is a big problem. This is probably winning. And I will get a pawn. God, this is, this is bloody awful. This is absolutely horrific. It's totally lost for me. Completely lost. I th <coughs> only bait shred of... Got to just keep try and grind him on time. There's literally probably zero chance of that. You can check me, can't you? I don't know why you didn't check me then. I managed to get a bit of time on him. Okay. Hmm. 
I'm just lucky. I'm just lucky. I'm just lucky. That was just a a very lame game. Oh, let's go for somebody new. Oh dear, Le Rose Purge, the Big Purge. Is that right? Is that the correct French translation? So we got a symmetrical English. You tell me. Interesting. I get a lot of E5 against the English as well. Um, and I, I was playing a guy the other day. And um, it was a really gutting. This is, this is the most 